Hi, I'm Professor Wheeler Winston Dixon, uh, Ryan Chair of Film Studies at the University of Nebraska, and I'm here to talk to you briefly about apocalyptic films. Uh, there's been a long history of apocalyptic films. Um, they fascinated uh, filmmakers since the medium began at the turn of the century. If you look at the films of Georges Méliès, whose scientific spectacles showed the destruction of the earth in one case, uh, to War of the Worlds um, in the 1950s, uh, in which the Martians just attack and destroy us, uh, to when worlds collide, in which another planet rushes towards Earth and destroys it, uh, to more recent films um, such as Independence Day, Alien Invasion, or 2012 by Roland Emmerich. All of these films are fueled by a desire um, to see the end of the world safely, to see this violence um, at a distance without risk to the viewer because the viewer can say look at that scene of terrific destruction but I've survived it I've survived this scene I witnessed the end of the world and I've come out the other side and I can tell you what it's like in other words it's risk without any, any genuine real risk but it offers something which is satisfying at a certain level because it basically removes the responsibility from the viewer because it allows them to uh, witness the apocalypse safely from a distance